Let's take a look at the stun keyword. Whenever a card is stunned, let's say we play this card and we're stunning this card, the card that is stunned will be exhausted. From there, it's exhausted as normal. However, with stun, the card cannot leave the exhausted position, which means that it cannot be oriented or readied by card effect or manually or during your regroup step until the card is no longer stunned. Now, if you're stunning a card with the keyword only, let's say a card says stun target card, then it will be stunned until the end of the turn. However, in this case, we are adding two stun counters. Stun counters, when they're played, so let's play this card. Let's put this one back here. So we're going to put our two stun counters onto our target card. When those counters land, the card will become exhausted because it now has been stunned. And then during each of that card's controller, that, that's me, right? That card's controller's um, regroup steps, this counter will go down by one. So eventually it will decrement until the card is no longer stunned. So we'll go from two to one during the first regroup step when it comes to me, then during my second regroup step, this stun counter will be removed, at which point I'm still in my regroup step. I get that free ready during the regroup step so I can get that card back into action if I need it to be. Now, that is how stun works.